So in today's video, I will show you how to enable the lap timer on your cluster using VCDS. So without further delay, let's dive straight into it. Now, before we dive straight into today's video, do me a favor, show me some love, smash that like and subscribe button, as well as turn on those notifications so that you can be the first one to catch the newest content. So with that being said, now let's dive into today's video and see what it has to offer. First, you're gonna click on select. Once the next page opens up, you're gonna go and click 17 instruments. You're gonna give it a couple seconds. Once this page loads up, you're going to select coding, then select long coding helper. You're gonna select yes. Then you're going to type in one and check bit three off for the lap counter, meaning that it's activated. After that, you're gonna close out of this window, select do it, select okay, give it a few seconds. Then after that, close controller, go back, go back again, and there you go, that's it. Okay, so there you go. I just showed you how to enable the lap timer on your cluster using VCDS. Now, I hope you found this information valuable and enjoyed the content. And if you did, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button for more content in the near future. On that YouTube, that's it for now. Until next time, take it easy.